YouTube, this is your boy Chase Beach. Right now I want to talk to you guys about Fast 8, The Fate of the Furious. Now I know I'm a little late on it, you know, because it came out like a few weeks ago and I saw it in theaters, man, and I was completely blown away, you know. The movie starts off pretty well, you know, we see Dom, you know, we see Dom and Letty together, you know, they're in Cuba and Havana, you know, doing it up, you know, just like newlyweds do. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yeah, they were just newly, newlyweds, you know, doing up on their honeymoon, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, we see Dom and, you know, Letty, you know, Dom's brother, I think his cousin or brother, you know, gets into some trouble with, with a guy and a local uh, street racer, and uh, Dom, you know, picks up for his cousin, and so <laughs> the guy says, "All right, you know, you didn't pay up on the payments. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to charge you." He said, "Listen, man, I got, I have the money. You know, this week, the, uh, the next week, or whatever like that." You know, the guy's like, "Nope." So Dom he takes up on takes upon his matter to race the street racer, street hustler, and the, a beat up beetle. I mean, it's really beat up, man. Like, it just looks terrible, looks disheveled. And so, and Dom literally won the race. He literally finished, he literally, he literally crossed the finish line on fire. I think that was the most bombing part I loved about the scene, and mostly, you know, then having the explosion. Then, when Dom's going back up to, you know, his place, you know, When, he go, when, he go, when he's going back up to his place, you know, he's met by this one girl, you know, she looks like she's having car trouble, you know, which is the biggest ploy, the biggest uh, decoy, and so she ends up saying, you know what, I've been watching you, you know, things of that nature, and so she shows Dom this video, I don't know, I, like all of us, we didn't know what she showed Dom at that moment, about what she showed him at all. Turns out, you know, he had Elena and his newborn son, whom he named Brian. Now, we all didn't know that Elena was pregnant at the time. She said, around, I think she said around the time when uh, Letty had just came out, you know, she found out she was pregnant, things of that nature. And so, unfortunately, I'm going to put some spoilers in there. Elena ends up dying, you know, being sacrificed for the sake of her son. And right in front of her son, that's really missing. That's what really pissed me off in the movie is the fact that the baby was in such danger the entire time, you know. <laughs> Morality kicked in, you know, so it kind of really pissed me off that it was kind of like that, you know. Then the she, the fact that her own, the baby's mother had to be killed right in front of him, that set me off too, you know. So a lot of triggers, and so this movie was an action packed from start to finish, man. You know, like I said, the flaming car finish, you know, the girl saying, "Listen, we got your son, we got your lady, you know. There's, we, there's only one way you can free them is if we do this one little thing for us." It turns out, you know. She's linked to the last movie, uh, Fast 6, you know, back when Owen Shaw, you know, the guy whom we all thought was crippled forever, forever, ever, forever, ever, yes, him. And so, Deckard Shaw, you know, has to be on board, you know, Hans is, you know, they have to go steal this EMP um, from this base in Germany, I think, and so, they get, they get the EMP and stuff like that, and then that's when Dominic Toretto turns completely rogue. You know, Max style off base, off the road, you know, and then that's when we realized that he turned rogue. You know, which really shocked us all. But, you know, we saw in the previews that it was getting real. And so, really, from start to finish, like, from that moment forward, you know, it was a lot of after that, you know, all kinds of questions. Why did he do it? Being one of them. Um, what did Dom show? What did that lady, what did Cypheris show Dom in that video? But, you know, Ramsey's still looking fine as ever. You know, Roman and Tez, Tez still being there. <laughs> really comic relief, a lot of a lot of good stuff, man. You know, one scene in particular, you know, when they go to Siberia, I believe. Um, and they're on, they're in, oh, I'm sorry, they go, they're in Iceland. Yeah, they're in Iceland. And, you know, there's a big old tank, you know, I think this is towards like the end, yeah. And so, you see the rock, you know, you see Hobbs, you know, get ready to launch this, this torpedo. And even her lady said, you know, he gets style points for that, which he does. I mean, come on. You're lingering on this ice, on fragile ice. You take a torpedo like this, you're going, you know, you're driving 40, 50 miles an hour or more. You know, you just lug it, lug that thing. You know, and it hits cars and big old explosion. And that's balling right there. You get style points. You do. You really get style points for that. Um, another thing is, <laughs> another one big scene is like when, uh, when uh, Cyphers was able to, uh, Make all those cars literally drive themselves, which really creeped me out, scared me, because I'm like, oh crap, these are the new kind of cars, somebody can actually do this to your ride. And so, 
you know, all these cars would start falling from this building by themselves, you know, driving by themselves, causing a huge, huge, huge pile up in New York. Things, like I said, things were getting real. You know, and then we saw what looked to be the demise of Deckard Shaw, you know, Dom shooting him, shooting him down, you know. <laughs> and we see Dom go off, uh, Terminator <laughs> on us, you know, trying to get the EMP, you know, I'm sorry, the, the nuclear football, you know, the codes and stuff like that. All to get his son, which all makes sense. But again, we didn't know that. We didn't have that knowledge. You know, again, you know, the kid still being endangered. But I love when Jason Statham, uh, a.k.a. Decker Shaw, you know, he saves the kid. They all die. You know, he puts on Alvin the Chipmunk <laughs> so that the baby can't hear the gunfire. You know, and, and he does it so well, doing doing everything with just one hand while the other arm is with the baby. Man, I just love those damn sequences. So damn ball. And so... Another fight was when you know, Himes is in prison for a short while, and he meets Decker Shaw, you know, and Decker Shaw calls him a wanker, you know, and then they all fight, you know. Then somehow, you know, Decker, able, Decker is able to get, like, a baton from one of the guards, and, you know, he breaks himself, he sets himself free, sets everybody free, and this is a huge juggernaut and gauntlet with every inmate, you know, all they're trying to attack each other, you know, and they're all scrapping, and it's just wonderful, man. And then Mr. Nobody, he's like, ah, you know, I'm glad you, you know, I thought this was, you know, what a, I thought you guys would have made this out. I thought you guys would have made it out. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm glad I thought you guys would have made it out of there <laughs> a lot quicker, you know. <laughs> it was so cool. But then seeing the newbie cop, you know, get darn near get choked out right before Hobbs even gets in jail. It's funny, too, you know. But then he ends up being one of the cool guys, too, that, towards the end of the movie. And then towards the end of the movie, you know, you see Ramsey asks Roman and Ted's like, okay, then what is my last name? And no one knows it, we, you know, because we only know her as Ramsey. You know, I got, I had that a good chuckle. And then Dom, you know, gives the baby his name, which is Brian. <laughs> and I'm thinking, I'm like, why wow, this is so cool? You know, it's still this film is really dark, but it was still alive at the same time, and you know, still carrying on that torch for Paul Walker, you know, who died unfortunately a few years ago. But you know, it was a really cool movie. I liked it from start to finish, and I recommended you guys go see it for real. Uh, it's your boy Chase. Would you guys like this video? Subscribe to the channel. Comment what you guys think about the video. What you guys thought of the movie and stuff like that. Would you guys think it's going to be a fast? Do you think it'll be a number ten? Let me know.